It all started when we found out that uh, our time, our, uh, I'm sorry, our paychecks have been coming up a little bit light. We were able to obtain our time card information, even though Peter didn't want to hand, our boss Peter didn't want to hand it out over to us. We found that uh, workers were owed almost $2,000 in stolen wages. We had an initial march on the boss. We demanded the payment of the stolen wages and the recognition of the union. Um, we recovered the majority of the wages, so some of the wages have still not been paid in full to workers. Uh, since then, he's ignored our calls to recognize the union, to sit down and meet with us. And uh, two workers have been fired. One worker was fired immediately uh, after the action. We did a phone tap for him, and at that time, yet another worker was fired. Throughout here, it's worth the rehiring of those workers, as well as other workers who have uh, faced um, um, action against them because of their support. I personally took a week off sick. It was authorized, and when I came back, I've been cut to only eight hours. Definitely, I feel like this is a result of my open support in the union. We have another worker who uh, found out about this picket, showed his you know, excitement in the morning um, on Friday, and then he got fired before the day was over. So we've got a brand new slew of people in there trying to bust the unions. So we're out here to demand the rehire of those workers and to show support for recognition of the union, as well as to recover the last of the stolen wages. We're overworked and underpaid, but Peter Erie's got his face. We're overworked and underpaid, but Peter Erie's got his face. At the end of my shift, which was approximately 3 o'clock in the afternoon, uh, corporate came in with Peter. They gave me my check for my wages that were owed to me that I had been shorted, along with a letter stating that I was being terminated for illegally accessing the system um, and releasing information to third parties. And in this, they were completely incorrect because A, I had the accessibility to the system. I did not hack their system to get the information that I had. And B, I did not release it to third parties. I released it to the employees. He um, decided that he would disassemble our frozen yogurt machine. Mistakenly though, he didn't turn it off first, so he assaulted himself with frozen yogurt. 